Hi guys, Hello. welcome. We're here, we're back. <laughs> we're not in the sunshine because it's too warm in the sunshine. We've got our shade on our makeshift bench. Yes, um, it's nice. It is very nice in the shade and a little bit of a breeze. So apologies for the breeze. Yes. So we did it. Yes. We actually have a floor. A floor. Upstairs. And it looks like a real room. Yes. Yes. Um, it needs a few finishing touches and I went to the big DIY store um, and I take you along, show you what it's like. <clears throat> I always find it interesting to see if these things are different country to country. So mm. let me know if it is different or if it's the same. Yes. We have just had an IBC delivered. Yes, about 10 minutes ago. 10 minutes ago. Yes. Um, yeah. Follow along and, and see how we get on. On yeah. a side note, we're going to try something different this weekend. We're going to try anyway, at least. We're going to it try. probably won't work, but we're going to have a go. You know us and things working, but we are going to, honestly, we are going to try. Yes. So here in the our town, there is an urban road race where guys on motorcycles race through the streets. It's yes. the, the circuit is all being prepared as we speak. Um, yes. And the race is actually tomorrow. And you'll see this today, Saturday, and the race is tomorrow. Yeah. And we're going to try and do lives from it tomorrow. We'll have to, a go, yes. Yeah, to show you what an absolutely mental, fantastic, wonderful day it is. We'll also take other footage and we'll make a video. Yes, indeed. So you'll see it that way as well. Yep. So uh, if you can, try and catch us live and hopefully we'll be able to make it work. Yeah. <laughs> you know us. So yeah. guys, enjoy the video. Hit that thumbs up if you do. Comments always welcome as ever. Yes. And uh, hopefully catch you tomorrow live. Yes, and go ITOR. Absolutely, ITOR. <laughs> ITOR for the win. <laughs> So, after being beaten by the heat yesterday afternoon, it was just too much. I just couldn't cope. Uh, I'm back on it. Lillian's uh, not long been arrived at work. So, I've uh, got myself some cold water ready. Dover's having a good sniff around. I don't know why, but he can. So, I got on with this and uh, see how we go. Okay. So, after a uh, my attempt to make a start this morning, it didn't work out. I am not very good at these sort of things at all. And my temper span is not as uh, long as other people's. I contacted Lillian, apologised, and she said to step away, step away and pick all your toys back up. So when I got home, there were still a few toys out the pram, but there you go. <laughs> Not an issue. Sometimes it just takes two brains or two half brains to make a whole brain. It's a bit like doing the plasterboard that took us ages to get our heads round and it was fine, we just got on with it. We finally got our heads round. Oh look what we've done. Ta da! Yes. It's gonna look ace. It is, and a cut out for around the plasterboard a bit so. I know. Those two standing up things are just being used as spaces. But they're long enough they don't fall down. <laughs> actual back there. Yes, so tombstones. Yeah. Might be the time to finish this. <laughs> uh, yeah, the other issues we found with having bartered, pre-owned upcycling ones is that whoever took it apart wasn't as gentle as they could have been. Yeah, that's, we now know what we're looking for and that there's quite a bit of damage. So be it, that's what happens when you when you recycle, upcycle, whatever you want to call it. Um, yeah, that was somewhat frustrating trying to get these two bits to join and it turned out it was because the teeth and tongue bits had been smashed and we didn't know what we were looking for. So, more steep learning curve, but mm. it's good, it's good. Yeah, I'm should. really pleased with how it's going to look. Well, look who's come to save the day. She's decided that it's enough already, we're working, she wants a fuss. She's falling off this step. Step finishes here. The rest of her is on me. <laughs> it's definitely first time with no longer work time. Exactly. Right? But look what we've achieved. Look how brilliant it looks. Yes. Really, really happy. Indeed, you should be. Such transformation. Yeah. Every time we finish something or get close to finishing, we're like, wow, look what a difference, look what a difference. But really, wow, look what a difference. It must be a stop time lock. Yeah, we've got a whole posse here now. Hello? Hello? What does everybody want? What does everybody want? Okay, right. 
So back at it tomorrow. One I more need, day. Well, yeah. an afternoon, really. I need to source some edging for when you go down over the steps here. Yep. Um, DIY store online. Don't know. We'll have a look tonight. Gonna need some for that one. And there's absolutely no point me talking to you about these steps because I'm just surrounded by dogs. Yeah. So we'll give it up for now, and we'll come back to it tomorrow. Indeed. Okay, so it's not to bore you with our floor laying. Done! We did it! Yes. Uh, we said before we had a few issues because it was recycled, recycled, reused and all that jazz. But oh. we did it. And banana walls, banana wibbly walls. wobbly, wibbly wobbly, in and out. It was more, I don't know, more like snake walls, aren't they? <laughs> That's the sort of like go like that. <laughs> Bastard by Alvaro and his team, but if they did follow the wall, which is what I asked them to do. Yes. Not realising what it would give us long term. We've had to do a bit of budget down here. The very last trim, which is two centimetres. Yes. Very last little bit. I wasn't able to. They, they got they, they're attached that way. If guy, if you know how click clap flooring works, they're attached that way, but not that way. They're butted up. But there's going to be a skirting on there, which will hold them down. Yes. So we're just going with that. Next job is to go to the DIY store, get the skirting for the room and the external corners for going outside and going down the steps. So then we can finish those, that step and then step, skirting, architrave. Room is finished, we can move in. Door. What? Room is finished. <laughs> yeah, okay, door. Go on the door and then the trim for the door. Anyway, what do you reckon, Dover? Oh, you think it's panty good? He slides his feet across the floor as he walks. Yeah, the one who's got so thick pads. Exactly. <laughs> anyway, call to the time. Yes. Right, well, finished work for the day and uh, I've come to the city, which in this case is Elche. And I've come to the DIY store and uh, looking for the skirting so we can finish that bedroom. And I've got a wee shopping list, a few other bits and pieces. I'm going to take you along with me. Well, before I go in, I'm going to have to check out the outside garden stuff. Dogs would like that. What's that supposed to be? One person? Two people? I think it's a sample. I guess it's a sample of what you can do. Yeah. Okay. Gosh, being out on a bike sound, sounds like a good idea, but I think in this heat, it might actually be a bit much. Hola, buenas. Oh, it's nice and cool in here, it's all air con. Bumpy. And I'm pushing a trolley. Opa. I thought about this, look. My trolley has a flag on it. It's taller than the umbrella. That looks like a good idea. Yeah. Going in our driveway on the patio. Yeah. That would be lovely, wouldn't it? All of this would be lovely. One day. One day we'll get a house finished and get a nice pretty outdoor area as well. 
be fair, there's nothing that technical about most of these. It's just the colours that drag your eye. And outdoor lights. Right. I'm going to the main store now and look for the bits I'm actually here for. Okay, in the store now. <coughs> oh, pretty colours. Um, as usual, I'm a girl. I like to look at things. <laughs> one day verbs, one day pretty things at the moment, still building. There's some pretty rugs. Prices are horrendous though. It's shocking. You sing wallpaper. That's funny. Okay. So I'm just gonna find the flooring because I need edging strip for the flooring. I am looking for um Oh, brain. Brain stopped working. Need to find my shopping list. <laughs> so, my shopping list I've got. The angle for the step, the skirting, oh I need an a, a angle cutter as well and then the glue for fixing it all down and anything else takes my fancy. Not really, I never do. Right, well I found the section that's uh, got the flooring. And it's a bit of a minefield. I'm looking for skirting. I'm also looking for the edging for the step. And I found it. And according to the price way, it's not bad. They're 15 euros each. I'm not impressed. Um, I've now got to choose a skirting. This is the great floor we've got. It's got a gap. I can't let it turn around. There's one to turn around. It's got a cutout in it. Oh, there you go. Like this white one. It's got a cutout behind it so that you can put cabling, I believe. Um, all the prices are a little bit clearer as mud. So I'm just going to work it all out. These are straight joiners, but like for kitchens. There's other skirtings over here in white as well. I'm going to have to go with the white, which they seem to have the most stock of. And I seem to be able to get a pack of five at 3.25 a metre. I pay 35 euros for 11 metres. That's doable. I need 17 for the bedroom. So it will also need to do downstairs, and if we get white, then the white will also go with downstairs. But it's obviously, there's plenty of it, so I'm not going to run out of it. I'll just have another bit of a nebby around and make sure that that's definitely all they've got. Make a decision and go for it. So, no doubt done a really stupid thing. What I haven't thought about is the fact we only have an ordinary car. And I have bought things. Long. This is going to be interesting to see if they fit in the car or not. So I ended up getting a new saw, a mitre block, glue for gluing this stuff down with, my skirting board and a couple of edgings for the steps. 
as I said, this is now going to be interesting. Definitely a two person job. There's a cushion in there. I've been given a cushion from work. It's a freebie for going on our make do bench. And I'm going to see if I can get this and to fit in there. And here, I still close the doors. Oh, it's just a two people job. Look at that. Made to measure. Right. Get the rest of this in. I might just have to have a sneaky coffee over there before my trip home. So I'm home now. We've unloaded everything. Yeah, the wind's up. I know. This is the cushion I was given from work. Um, it's had buttons in it before and they've gone a little bit rusty, but it, the buttons were taken out so the cover could be washed and they haven't been replaced because... It wasn't for the people who wanted it in the first place, but I've been given it. I'm supposed to put it going in the skin. It's a bit fit. Is it a temporary cushion? It's a temporary cushion. Not a Humphrey cushion. No. Temporary cushion. Oh. Hang on. It's not big enough. Not big enough. We made a bigger one than that. That's a shame. Well, Dover, you've got a new bed then tonight. <sighs> And Loki. Um, yes. Yeah. Loki doesn't tend to sleep on the bed. He seems to get too hot. Right, put that down in the caves. For the dogs. For the dogs. Yes. It's very pretty and everything. It's very stripy. Very stripy. Yes. <laughs> okay. Well, it would have been very hot. I was about to say comfy. But you squish <laughs> into it. Oh, that's warm. Yes. Right. I'm stood outside with a thick black t-shirt. What a mistake to make her. Yes, it's not very particularly comfortable. Right, let's go home then. I, uh, I need to change my uh, attire. Cheers. Right, next thing just been delivered. So, uh, IBC. So, uh, right, I'll get it guided in. Right, it's here. We've got one, finally. Just need to mark out where I want it to go, which is approximately here-ish. So we need to level that bit of land off. The guy, the guy who dropped it off is uh, his English guy. Um, it's just a coincidence it is, but he's decided that <laughs> Lillian's no longer called Lillian. <laughs> he insists she's called Lorraine. Which is well funny. She's not impressed. So, right, I get all this lot shut up, and uh, we'll make plans for that. And that's uh, what we're going to use for all our wastewater from the reverse osmosis system. And then hopefully, we'll be able to uh, have ourselves a little gardening plot there. That's the plan. <laughs>